Hi, this is Cole with CJC Off-Road, and today we have this 2018 Ford F-250. We'll be installing one of our favorite kits on it, the Carly 4.5 inch backcountry. Now, this customer came to us looking for a setup that he could tow his, uh, his toy hauler setup to the desert with, uh, also something that he could improve ride quality with, and his requirement was to run a 4.5 inch lift on this truck. Uh, so what we set him up with was the Carly backcountry base 4.5 inch kit. Uh, along with the sway bar, end link, and drop option, and the rear out of packs. Uh, the rear out of pack setup on this truck is designed to retain the factory F250 towing capacity, which is really important for this particular build, uh, while still improving the ride quality. At the heart of this kit, we have the Fox 2.0 remote reservoir shocks. Uh, this is one of the key components that makes this kit uh, what it is. Fox actually produces these shocks private label for Carly suspension with this custom tuning in them. Uh, the way Carly tunes these shocks is to initially be on the lighter side to help with street ride, but then the shock will actually ramp up on the harder hits to allow for both uh, control when towing and even uh, off-road to allow for uh, improved handling as well. Uh, this backcountry shock setup is one of our favorites in terms of value. Uh, it runs about half the price of a King shock package while still uh, including remote reservoirs to help with heat when off-roading long term. Um, this is one of our most popular shock packages as well, just because this is a very functional setup for a daily driver and weekend warrior. Supporting the front of the truck, we have these Carly 4.5 inch multi-rate coil springs. These springs are designed both for on-road ride quality and off-road performance, and a lot of that is achieved through the multi-rate uh, nature of these springs. The uh, initial rate is meant to be lighter, as these springs compress, the spring rate ramps up to allow for both the best of on-road ride quality and off-road performance. Uh, these springs are also designed to increase travel considerably. In fact, if you put most, uh, say like an equivalent height, like a four inch lift spring next to this particular spring here, the, uh, the other spring would probably sit about eight inches shorter than this spring. Uh, so basically, this spring you put on the truck, it's actually slightly compressed at right height and what that allows for is uh, significantly improved wheel travel, um, especially when it comes to droop travel, which is something you just won't find with other lift kits on these trucks. So one of our favorite components in this Carly kit, these radius arm drops. Uh, what they're designed to do is to retain the correct caster with four and a half inches of lift. And the nice thing about these things is no cutting or modification is required. Uh, this is very rare for a lift kit of this design. Uh, most of these lift kits, you're having to drill a bunch of extra holes, things like that. When Carly prototyped these 2017 Ford radius arm drops, they designed it so it literally uses three bolts that bolts into factory locations. Uh, makes this super nice for guys that saw in this kit in their driveways. Uh, obviously makes it nice for shops like ours as well. Uh, it saves a lot of steps and you know it fits right every single time. So one thing that separates Carly suspension from most suspension manufacturers is the little details. Uh, take for instance this reservoir mount. Uh, this reservoir mount is included in all the Carly 4 suspension setups that use remote reservoirs on the front end. And it basically this reservoir mount goes above the coil spring isolator and allows the uh, reservoir to sit uh, uh, basically horizontal in the front fender. Uh, this is something that's really nice because you're not having to cut the factory mounts, no drilling, nothing like that. Super simple, super well thought out, and something that you usually that you'll only really find in a Carly suspension kit. Keeping the front axle centered under your truck, we have the Carly adjustable track bar. Uh, it has a lot of trick little things going on. Uh, frame or axle side of this track bar has a domestic FK rod end uh, with a unique jamnet design that's, desi that's designed to actually clamp the rod end into the track bar. A uh, common complaint on adjustable track bars is uh, the jamnets uh, working themselves loose. Uh, Carly, in an effort to prevent that, actually has this clamping jam nut design uh, that's unique to the Carly uh, adjustable track bars at this point. Um, it also has a spacer that goes on the axle side. Uh, instead of using a drop pivot arm and a track bar drop bracket, Carly uses uh, this axle, this spacer, in order to keep the geometry as flat as possible on the front end while maximizing the amount of travel. On the frame side, Carly has this, uh, they call it their cub, uh, cub joint. Uh, the cub joint is designed to be as heavy duty as possible, while unlike a Heim, uh, still allowing for some movement. Uh, this is important uh, because this actually helps to minimize steering wheel feedback, a common complaint on these Ford, uh, this, these Ford M250, F350 trucks. Carly supplies these heavy duty uh, sway bar components as well. 
uh, uses this fabricated sway bar drop. You can see it's all MIG welded, powder coated. And this custom end link set, uh, which actually includes multiple grease points, something not found on a lot of aftermarket sway bar end links. Uh, this is actually technically an option on these Carly kits, although it is something that in order for the front sway bar to have the correct geometry is a requirement. Um, so if you are looking to order one of these four and a half inch Carly systems, we definitely recommend the front uh, sway bar components, which are the sway bar drops and the sway bar end links. So Carly suspension also includes a lot of other smaller components with these kits. Uh, one being the stainless braided brake lines. Uh, these are actually um, nicer than most of the aftermarket brake lines we've installed on, on trucks here at our shop. A lot of brake lines are cheap Chinese products that we get. They're hard, they don't fit very well. Uh, they don't seal very well. Uh, Carly uses uh, actually crown brake lines on their kits. And these, in our experience, are the best domestically sourced brake lines available. Uh, they also include these one degree caster shims of the four and a half kits. While most lifts, they just settle for whatever amount of caster uh, they achieve with their radius arm drops. Carly's suspension systems actually have a one degree caster shim in order to dial in the caster that much better. Uh, what this translates to is uh, uh, more steering wheel control with the truck, uh, better handling, and a closer to factory alignment even though the truck is lifted. I can't emphasize enough the little details on these Carly kits. Uh, here's a great example right here. Uh, this is the front bump stop drop. Uh, so whereas most lift kits it's just either a big rubber piece that slides into the factory bump stop location or you know a cheap cast part this is actually a laser cut mig welded and powder coated uh, front bump stop drop super trick and again it shows the level of, of detail that carly puts into these systems so last but not least uh, this is not included standard with the backcountry kit although highly recommended for any lifted uh, ford super duty is the uh, high mount steering stabilizer. Uh, it is designed to minimize steering wheel feedback on these trucks. And it is actually made of stainless steel. Uh, so if where you live, they salt the roads, you have harsh winters. Uh, these actually tend to age very well. Uh, we've had a lot of positive feedback with these from customers. Uh, I'd say it's a must for any lifted Ford F250, F350 Super Duty. So just wrapped up the installation of the Carly 4.5 inch backcountry on this truck. Uh, at the beginning, the customer's goals were to have a soft riding setup that you could still use functionally for towing. I'd say we've definitely achieved that goal. This truck rides considerably softer than stock. The weight capacity is retained thanks to the Carly Adapex. And uh, couldn't, say, couldn't be happier with the outcome. Uh, there's a reason why the Carly Backcountry is one of the most popular systems that we sell. Uh, it's great for guys that you know looking for a, a smooth riding, uh, you know, better handling daily driver uh, without necessarily spending the kind of money it takes to get into King Shocks. Uh, I'd say uh, this system will suffice for 99% of people uh, you know, that aren't trying to do desert bombing with these trucks. And uh, yeah. Uh, so thanks for watching. Um, any questions, feel free to reach out and many more of these videos to come.